evening again. Madam Mayor, members of the City Council, Jason Behrman. City Manager, several items happening uh, this week and following to report on. First of all, we already did the proclamation for Arbor Day. As a reminder, there is a tree planting going on um, this Friday. Um, we certainly encourage people to come out and help with the volunteers that are going to be planting. Um, to date, there have been over 1,300 new trees planted in Elk Grove uh, since 2020. Uh, Youth Commission is accepting applications for the 2023 scholarship awards through Monday, May 1st. Four scholarships valued at both $500 and $1,000 will be awarded in three categories. Merit-based, outstanding achievement and exceptional youth. Students must live and attend or attend an Oak Grove High School. Visit the City's Youth Commission webpage for details. Um, big Day of Giving is coming up. Over the past year, the city has provided funding and services to over 39 or for, for 39 local nonprofit organizations valued at more than $1.4 million. The work of those organizations is amplified further through personal contributions. May 4th is the annual Big Day of Giving, a day when personal contributions to, um, to participate in the local nonprofits are matched by the Sacramento Region Community Foundation. You can view and support Elk Grove's participating nonprofits on Big Day of Giving by visiting Big Day of Giving. Org. The Strategic Planning and Innovation Office is currently recruiting residents and business owners to participate in a new climate ambassador program. These are compensated positions for those interested in issues centered around climate change, environmental justice, equity, renewable energy, clean transportation, water conservation, and recycling and waste. Climate ambassadors will communicate with organizations, groups, and individuals on how Elk Grove can be a healthier, more sustainable, and resilient city. For more details, visit the city's website. Uh, we're excited to have the, uh, our own Elk Grove Aquatic Center, District 56, host the California, the CIF, Sacramento San Joaquin Section Swim Championships, May 3rd through 5th. The event features the trials and finals for the region's top high school athletes and is expected to track over 1,200 attendees, including coaches, staff, volunteers, and swimmers. Meet times are daily from 6.30 a.m. to 3.30 at District 56. We're excited to have the, our outdoor markets return next week. Season's seasonal open air markets will return. The neighborhood good market at District 56 will run every Thursday from 5 to 8 p.m. And Old Town Elk Grove Farmers Market will be back at the Old Town Plaza every Sunday from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. Please stop by to shop local, support micro businesses, and connect with the community. And finally, this is a reminder, the city is asking residents to submit their suggestions and their preferred locations for new community EV charging sites through an online survey that will close on Monday, May 15th. Details are available on the city's website, and that concludes my report. I'm happy to answer any questions the council might have. Thank you, sir, for your report. Any questions or comments from colleagues? All right, seeing none, we'll move on to our next item. Thank you.